nice to meet you to this new episode of Wikbit. On my kitchen table I have a Sony Mini Disc Deck MDS minus GE510 510. And um, I have no information what's happened with it and so we would like to make a test. But first <laughs> uh, Mr. Brush. <laughs> We are uh, told the story now a thousand times, filled thousand times, and uh, we are uh, never more interested what's happened with the background on this story with the dust. <laughs> and so I connected to the mains, and um, what's happened? Mm, standby is blinking, and um, I switch it on. Uh -huh, no disc. Mm -hmm. This is working. Interest wise, the Sony are not um, not so. Yeah, I have a mini disc from Sony, and I put that in. Now, TUC is reading. What's next? Hmm. This is interest. Hmm. It checked. <laughs> this camera. Was this Kira? Hmm? Why this Kira? No way. <laughs> I have not much to get this uh, mini disc machines in case of that we have not so much mini disc in Australia. But this is an interesting setup. Uh, it's a checked. Okay. And so uh, what are we gonna do? We would like to open it. Take a screwdriver across and um, uh, the first what we uh, what we want to make we disconnect it from the mains and uh, we are open it. I hope so. We also need this cup from England and uh, I would like to open this now. Never repair a drive from that. Oh yes, I repaired one time a drive. I remember um, it was uh, it was um, something with the mechanic, uh, a mechanical issue. Oh yeah. <laughs> Long time ago. <laughs> what can be? Uh, if you need a spare part for this, it's very complicated to get. In case of, uh, I think so, Sony are not uh, building this machine anymore. Oh, here, it open. Uh -huh. I can open it. That's nice. I can open it. <laughs> uh -huh. We must bend it a little bit. Uh huh. And um, we have a watch inside. Uh -huh. Interest. <laughs> No, transformer. <laughs> it looks like from the CD player. It's also the same uh, same mechanism. And it smells. Mm. Also here we have a battery. Uh -huh. Maybe it has a memory too. Mm. So, uh, we can also check up what's the battery. Uh, we take this, put it to work, and you can see that. Okay, and um, we check up the battery here. The minus, huh? <laughs> 9.5. Uh -huh. Maybe this is okay. Oh no, no, it's not okay. I think so. It's a. Uh, it's needed more memory. But. Uh, we must have a watch in the plan. What's happened with this? And now I would like to change it to the other direction so that you can orientate it better. What are you gonna do here? And uh, connect it to the mains and insert the disc. Switch on, okay. No. It spins.
But I have a, a really big problem, uh, how I can see, is the laser working or not? Uh, no, <laughs> this is not possible. To do this, oh, is it possible? Uh? <laughs> yeah. We can do nothing in real. Maybe with a, with a other disc, this is maybe possible. I have also more discs here, and um, here one, look, uh, also a good known, co well known company, it's TDK, uh, maybe we see, is it spinning or not? Yeah, it spins. But, you can see no laser light. So what I would like to do now is to deinstall the, the disk and uh, have a watch inside the disk to um, to check out uh, is it possible to we build out now <laughs> look these tiny screws <laughs> little 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 it's little little little. Uh, we open up now this and um, build out the disk and uh, maybe the laser is not working also. Um, I don't have a possible check method to see the laser. It's impossible from outside. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have now here, this is a... Uh, huh. <laughs> it's not... It's not so easy to to remove this <laughs> with not bending the 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 cover. <laughs> it's oh, here. Here is this eventual. Uh -huh. And can we remove this? Oh no! Is that possible? We have it here, but uh, I think so. This uh, schnappy. Is it going this way? Mm, can we can we remove it without destroying it? It's interesting. Huh? Maybe it's not possible, huh? Yeah, if I if I bend this, then it's all this defect, huh? How they how they build it? Aha! Uh -huh. It's possible to remove it, but. Uh, uh, it's not so, not so nice. <laughs> Impossible to remove it. Uh, you can see the, the issue. <laughs> this is an interesting. We must remove this outside, uh, but uh, uh, maybe with a smaller screwdriver. Uh, I have a small one here, but is that possible? Oh, look, it's smaller. Can we can you fix this problem? Yeah, 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 yeah it's <laughs> no, this is very uh, very little. Uh, and now the disc out. Mm. Look, <laughs> it's interesting. Huh? Can, but uh, in which says uh -huh, it must be so. Okay, good. And then uh, I must bring that back in the position and uh, closing the screws. What do I would like to make with this test is uh, to see how the laser is uh, switching on or not, and then I can see. Maybe possible um, that um, it's better to understand. I think the laser is not switching on uh, uh, or too too weak. Maybe the laser beam is too weak, and uh, so we must make a special disc to see that operation. Uh -huh. Here we can go. It's not. 
Not good. <laughs> Look, <laughs> this is the 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 record uh, disable switcher. <laughs> uh -huh, okay, I must uh, I must bring it in position. Come here. So now it's okay. Now it's good. <laughs> Everything will be good if you do that. What I want. <laughs> Ah, so it's really tiny. I mean, who can build this? It's so small. Look at this. <laughs> the screws. So I make a empty disc and hope so uh, that we can. Uh, that you can use it now in this case to make it possible so where is the so is the here is the input so no laser light yeah no laser light Oh, it's a laser light, yeah? It's, I see it, I see it. Now you can see this, and I insert the disc, and uh, maybe you can see the laser light. You can see the beam, the red point. Come on, again. Now you see it. The red point is coming. <laughs> now I checked. What now happened is I would like to control um, the laser pick up and so I must press this button and insert the connector, the main release them and now it's in the it's in the menu. Temperature adjustment and laser diode power adjustment and laser diode power check and we press this we say yes and there is written laser diode 0.9 milliwatts <laughs> for ten dollars <laughs> no it's not dollars <laughs> it's it's a hex number and uh, you cannot align it here but if you go out and go to the left adjustment and say yes then you can see this here, you can change this uh, from F, this is a hex number, from F to 10 and so on. And um, it's possible to see it, um, the laser. Mm, here you can see the laser point, now it's a 10 hex. And I will um, decrease it. So it's now on 6 hex. And now it's weak, very weak. It's now on one hex. So two hex, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. A, B, C, D, E, F, 10, 17, one F, you see, it increase. Now it's on 27. 2F, 30. We are now on 30. <laughs> Focus. The Focus doesn't work. It was the laser adjustment. Normally it should be at 0 0.9 milliwatts optical out, but I cannot measure it. I don't have a measurement instrument. I know a guy from Toshiba, they have in the 90s a measurement instrument for laser power, but uh, for the optical output. But the problem is that uh, he, he he's passed away and yeah, rest in peace. Yes, uh, then we have this um, focus biasing uh, check and we do that. Uh, I take an original, man, you cannot believe I have an original Sony disc here. Yeah. 
we put it in and we're doing the check and we say yes doing the check <laughs> it's 7350 <laughs> too much too much errors <laughs> that means we go back and adjusting the focus and say yes There are two points, the point A and B. These are the minimum and maximum focus and uh, we hope so that we can change it. Mm. Should be come in the middle. No, it doesn't work. Oh, no. Should be 20. <laughs> what do you see? It's unbelievable. What I found out is in this drive, if I go to the laser, uh, to the laser adjustment, and I put it to the one F, yeah, and say yes, yes, okay, yes, go out, go to the um, uh, biasing. And say here, yes, this is much lower. <laughs> it should be 20. The arrow bits should be 20. If I'm changing the position, it's going to be higher. I increase it or increment it. Normally it should sink, <laughs> but in this case, yeah. be too high, be 19. Okay, C is in between, you see that. I, th I think this is the lowest uh, or the highest and this is the lowest and this is in the middle um, of the focus point and so it should be work but uh, doesn't work correct so switch off switch off uh -huh, we must disconnect it from the mains connect it to the mains uh -huh. switching it on no disc putting it in and you are the Sony of my life, we need an amplifier um, and um, audio <laughs> and the player should be run, put it to the output and play. It's interesting, it's playing. Very funny. Klingt gut, was? Und nun möchten Sie natürlich wissen, ob Sie gewonnen haben. Das haben wir gleich. Warten Sie es an. Uh, interest. Now it is running. <laughs> Why? It's only a... Uh... Oh no. Kleiner Toast. Pech im Spiel. Glück mit Musik. Now no, it's Auf working. Hören Sie die neuesten Titel von Jean-Michel Jarre, den Manic Street Preachers und Blue Emerson. Und? Now it's running. Nobody knows why. But a, a self-burned uh, self number is not running. Believe me. This is a... The, the, the difference between this disc and this disc is that, that this disc is a recordable and this is re pre-recorded, that means it's a, it's, a, it's a printed CD really. And this is a, this is a optical, magnetical CD, it has not so much level uh, on, the, on the noise, noise to signal. Yeah, you see, the TOC reading doesn't work. That means the laser gives no power, much power. This is uh, too, too less. We have too much errors. Yeah, 
This is the, the principle of this system. This is a CD. It's printed and you can see it can read. In place also. But uh, a normal uh, self-recorder cannot be bad. But I have an idea. I go there, disconnect all the power and <coughs> The first what I'm gonna do, I write here five one zero oh, on it. Okay, this is the five hundred ten, and I interchange it <laughs> to other drive. Because I have found out that I have a own <laughs> have my own CD player, uh, not CD player, <laughs> my own mini disc drive, and so we would like to interchange it. I'm interested. Uh, what on the screen? Look, be careful. This is not so, not so. These cables are you don't got so and now I have a second machine <laughs> here we have also this is the 500 and if it's possible it's this is working machine machine is working so I disconnected here I hope so it's not destroyed after I connect it to the other chassis and I put a big M on it. It's mine. Yeah. So um, this is for the next test. We check it up. Can it work or not? With feeling I say, yeah, correct. I remember the, the the song is calling you are the Sony of my life or so <laughs> funny now we connect it and we switch it to the on and and TUC reading Don't read the TUC. It checked. Uh huh. Interest. My drive is also not working. That means we have a power fail. We must understand. Okay. I hope so now my drive is not defect. Okay. We switch it off. We go to the to the adjustments and twelve is on number twelve written. Twelve is the is the is the thing and what was the bias check? Twenty, twenty three, twenty. C is fourteen. Mm -hmm. You can see the drive. It's under three. <laughs> it's three. C is fourteen. Uh huh. C is fourteen, and we go out. C play mode. What is doing now? I don't know. So we go out of this. This check and this adjust is. A is 14, A is 14, B is 14, and C is 14. Uh -huh. 14, 14, 14. Okay. But uh, interesting is that, that, and does it here play? Not adjust, check. We say only check. 
put in. Look, it's higher. The error rate is higher. It's around 20 to 13, 40. Huh? Uh, this is the drive we saw, so near the end. Huh? But it's running. Switch it off, switch it on. Turn it on. What you must measure is also the, uh, the, the focus. Where are you? The black is uh, good, not good for this camera. I know. Mm. <laughs> I must have an interchange between this. The oh no, it doesn't work. Maybe the power supply is also defect. Put now the original back in case of that. That maybe it's a capacitor problem. We must measure. First, we must look in the plan, in the service plan, and then we can say this drive is maybe I go to 12. Huh? It's uh, it's a it's a good idea to go with the laser to 12, and don't have this uh, this issue with the alignments. 12 and 14, 14, this is a good, mm -hmm. <laughs> should be, should be good, but I think, so these electrolytic capacitors are maybe defect, this, 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 this. thousand microfarads, should we interchange this, ah. but first measure, maybe the big capacitor is defect, yeah, but this have a 15,000 microfarads. Why? Why they doing 16 volts? 15,000 microfarads. Uh -huh. <laughs> very, very funny. <laughs> but now I must uh, also install my drive back. You can stack it. You can see. You can stack it. This is the one, and this is the second. Um, you need special fingers for that work. And now it's in, and now it's never more, never more working. <laughs> this is the best then. And we switch it to the on. reading oh it's reading okay and playing also though yes we checked but the see the system is super I don't understand why it's not so why don't the market yes Only for short. Uh huh. Out. Susie Q, huh? <laughs> okay. This will work. The, the self burned uh, CDs will work. I mean, this is an, another self burn CD, it's a DVD RV, RW. Um, this is a special CD with magneto optical. Um, um, what's called like this word? I don't remember it. Um, I must say that in a second video. So, have magneto optic, this have magneto optical properties. Hmm. Yeah, or in other words, characteristics. Uh, this this little mini disc, and it's super. You look, you can now see it. It spins. Here we are. So we give that back. Disconnected from the mains. In case of that, that a screw is falling in during the installation, and uh, we don't do that. 
And in this machine they have a 22,000 microfarad capacitor. I'm, I, are they crazy or what? Why they don't build in 4 times 4,700 microfarads? No, they build in a big capacitor that you not can buy or what? I mean, this is not a normal standard electrolytical capacitor. Also, Philips Overdrive with their 6,800 microfarads. They don't get to put two of them in. No, they're making one. I don't know why. But the interesting thing is that on these machines is the, the, uh, the compressor. There is uh, different compressions uh, from different machines. It's called like ATRAC. There is version one and two and three and other. It's it's very interesting how they build it up and they they said at the first that should be not a frozen system. Uh, it's a it's a it's a extended systems. These discs are initialized first and after the initialization from the table of content, the TOC, then the disk says in which compression rate is recorded and so on and also how much data on it, blah blah. <laughs> this is interesting. This is the this they think further, yeah, in this time. But what we can do, we can measure the the, the voltage but the voltage um, we measure with an oscilloscope and um, we have one oscilloscope, I bought that new, it's super the old one. <laughs> I don't make an advertisement for it but the old one is a super, super thing. Look here and we start it. But I don't know now where the, the, the super thing is that if you have a ground then you don't disturb the ground with it. We must also <laughs> be here in the position that we can see it. Uh, it's very easy, we put it here. <laughs> you see, this is cool. And um, the thing is that I must disconnect this. Is it on? No, it's not on. We must uh, searching the failure from the power supply. But I don't remember where is the test points where we can measure it. Um, <laughs> I'm not so specialized in mini disc. I understand how it works so a little bit but uh, in real um, I don't understand it. <laughs> See, CD players are more my, my home. Oh, a little bit noise on it. So what does that mean? Uh, we must uh, go to the channel and say to them a DC coupling. No, we need an AC coupling. AC coupling for measurement. And then we measure. Oh my gosh. There is a. Can we change the A and the B? Huh? Measurement range. Measurement range cursor. Cursor. Cursor looks like good. It smells like smoke here. Cursor. And here. Oh, it's it's better. It was better, but here not good. Not so good, huh? Should we change this electrolytical capacitor? We change it. Huh? It's on the ground. Huh? This is uh, on the minus. Huh? But how high it is? How high is this measurement? And we need the cursor. Uh, voltage time on. Uh, measurement. Measurement. We need the. Uh, I go back. Uh, a here is A and is here is B. B. We put B here. Ah, we make it a little bit louder, huh? Louder should be better. 
So loud, huh? Is that good for you? And horizontal. Mm, we change the time position. Huh? Is that good? Uh, we can froze it. Huh? Play, froze it, froze it, and we go back to the measure. Go to the B. Measure it under the B and now the A. A little bit higher. It's around 296 millivolts. Uh, zero, zero point three volts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we can change it. It's a good idea. I change it. Oh, what we gonna do now? We they installed the uh, they installed the board and uh, disconnecting from the mains. I said and uh, now I turning this machine around for so that you can see what I'm doing here. Uh, yes, and in this video I would like to ask Plumpik. Uh, did you know? Uh, uh, did you think about uh, what 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 for a high fidelity machine we should build? Mm, uh, my idea is um, yes. The first idea was to build a CD player in all their components, uh, but uh, it's complicated to tell. Uh, I disconnected here these cables. Be careful, like me. Uh, and uh, uh, the idea is uh, to building the own amplifier, but not an amplifier like you know. Um, an amplifier should be also have the possibility to have, for my uh, understanding, I need eight inputs. <laughs> you say, what? Eight inputs? For what? Uh, it's very simple to understand. It's that, that I need, uh, I have a, a collection of CD players and so I can connect it to all at the same time. Uh, they are on my cupboard. And uh, this will be nice. Oh, it's really warm. No, it's not warm. It's not warm. I can open this. Uh huh. This is interest. I must press it and lift it. Press and lift. So, are we are here ready to go? No. I have here a section. It is with a plastic pin connected. And if you put that board out, look, wonderful. <laughs> but the brown board, ah, I like the blue ones from the NAD. But uh, <laughs> the defects, not so. <laughs> there are a lot of defects. But some are came from the parts, I think. This is not, it's not a construction uh, issue, it's a, so, <laughs> super, this with the trafo, the transformer is here, awesome. Hey, cool, what's this? Rico, look, Rico, it's a printer company, or, it's really Recon or Rico or so, so you can see. <laughs> We change bars. We need to change bars. Which is yeah. these two what we're gonna do is uh, we take the pump the sucker <laughs> is going on with this the pump don't suck anymore maybe it's full 
fooling us. If not, so I take this. If it doesn't want. Now it's okay. Now it's good. I take new, two new capacitors where they are. Oh, here. Here it is. Look. It's also a thousand. <laughs> it's not from JV Co. It's from Cheng X. <laughs> I think so. It's the same. <laughs> the same quality. 50 volts. Poo. I don't have 50 volts. Yeah, 50 volts here. It cannot be. I tell you, it's no 50 volts. Or I can measure it and I must order. Yeah, 50 volts. 50 volts in a machine like this, no way. 24 volts, okay, but no 50 volts. Oh, they are crazy. They are nuts. Maybe nuts. So, Da, 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 da. So, here, here. Two thousand microfarads. Ah, it's weak. Not good. Not good. And this. It's good. Okay, I built in this 50 that is good on this side and the other bit on the other side and I mean 50 volts. No, I don't do that. I built in a new one, 35 volts. But if it explodes, then I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't measure the volts. If it's not explode, then it's okay. Normally you should interchange it with the same voltage or higher, but in this case we say no, we don't do that. Minus and plus. Don't interchange this. The capacitor will be explode. <laughs> During a mass working fast, or I'm doing my job fast in the older days, ago 20 years. So I have the <laughs> I have the volume that I must work so fast and I was so tired and it was also hard to work. <laughs> and then <laughs> a lot of these explodes <laughs> in front of my face in the TV set. So I repaired also TV sets. Cutting the leads. Okay. That sounds good. I hope so. It's not so high energetic so that you can use it. <laughs> These are the tabs. <laughs> if not, I'm very sorry. Don't do that, what I'm doing now. Giving back. Giving back the giving back the board. What I also don't understand why they give sometimes uh, uh, sometimes a uh, a plastic stand here inside, and then they have around the screws. For what are they doing this? Oh. They do that for mounting it, okay? Uh, I only would like to um, install the what? The transformer. This is a good idea. Only the transformer. With one screw. Mm -hmm. Take this. Hope so. 
there is now now I changed the electrolytic uh, capacitors and um, no disc okay what's happened spins on spins on <laughs> TUC reading but no nothing <laughs> Zack eject and the original Sony disc the master printed I think so we have also the same effect on the other CD player on the other machine is a 12 and 14 mm -hmm. we eject it's automatic eject mm -hmm. okay now we would like to also analyze the capacitors and wrong thing. Oh, what's happened? <laughs> Look, <laughs> it's the same defect as before. <laughs> oh, time out the battery over. I don't know. Ah, okay, we check up the following. Uh, we change the position that you can see this I disconnect the, the mains pressing for the service menu the AMS button and insert the power it's connected now I'm in the adjust in the in the menu and so I insert the disk go to the laser check laser adjustment go here it's written on 1F and I put it to the 12 back. Maybe this is correct. I don't know because I cannot measure it. I don't have this measurement instrument. Say yes, say yes. And then I go to the EFL power adjustment. Oh no. Focus bias. And <laughs> nothing. Look, nothing. I can change. It's totally worst. Oops. What is now? What shall I say to the laser drive, to the laser division device <laughs> uh, from the Sony uh, MDS? JE5110. It's complicated to understand and no data coming down and sometimes data coming down. I can load the lowest was uh, a little bit for a half second or a second uh, was a 100 was the error rate and um, it should be under 20 uh, for a perfect uh, result but um, never happened 20 or under it. Having 100, 200, 300, 400, this was the lowest, but it was yesterday and uh, today <laughs> doesn't work anymore. So um, I think so the laser light is dropping down or you can align it higher and low. No energy is on the, on the laser beam. Also the high should be very uh, intensive, yeah, but it's not, it's poor, it's really poor. If you like my channel, please subscribe and I say thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.